Hello, greetings. So you see, I'm going to talk about uh, this tragedy for the Shias. Uh, it's been really tragic for the Shias. Uh, if you are a Sunni Muslim, at least if you know, if you find out that your religious uh, hadiths, hadiths are religious, the sayings and of uh, Prophet Muhammad and what he did and through the Sahabas and sometimes through him, God knows, chain of narrations about the Prophet. At least you can uh, join the Shias and you still get Prophet Muhammad, but in a very high, through the Imams that we thought were true and the others, but unfortunately. So this has happened. That's why the Shias could not take Alama Madlisi as their Hayat al Kulub as their most reliable book. And so the Shias are four reliable books are different than the Sunnis, but these are the four reliable books, let's see. Shias books. Um, uh, Abdul Muttalib uh, taking, you know, threatening to kill Amina, taking a sword out, crying out to her, show me my child and this and that. Trauma. Four books, yeah. So Allama Madlisi's book is not the Hayat al in this. Then where do we find? I don't know. Sorry, I have not read the al -istis, istis Sar, Istibsar by Sheikh Muhammad Dusi, Tahdib uh, al Ahkam by Sheikh Muhammad Dusi, Man la yurid yudu, oh God, Al Fah. Oh, today my Arabic Man la yurid. Durhu al Faki. I don't even know Yadruhu al Faki. Kitab al Kafi. So these are the most Shia Muslims use different books of hadith from those used by other Muslims who prize the six major hadith collections. In particular, 12 verse Shia consider many Sunni transmitters of Hadith to be unreliable because many of them took the side of Abu Bakr, Omar Osman and Ali instead of only Ali and the rest of Muhammad's family. So I could go on grandson of the arms of It's come on me. Uh, so the la it's come on me to show the Shias what a tragedy. So when my brother was in the hospital, I did not pray to God or uh, I was just in the sense that not the Shia God, Siyabi Masama. For the sake of your brother Imam Raza, I did not do all that. I call out to Bibi Zainab, even when the voices were coming. Yeah, Bibi Zain. I was like, no, no, no. Like that, right? Sorry. Uh, I don't have to say sorry. So I've explained, explained Surah Noor Ayat 33. Any Shia who wants uh, to discuss this, I'm not uh, uh, overall like a Christian prince can really answer back truthfully. He's very knowledgeable in the group. Then his, his mind goes there and he can tell you understanding Shia is not. So if you really want to challenge your faith, 
Oh, sorry. I'm on Facebook. I just uh, shared this live stream on Understanding Shahzam. Huh? Everything beautiful, everything truthful. I have to. Oh, God. That's my voice. Terrible. Ex St. Josephine's Grace for Madam Musid Manira Gosar. Sorry for the background. Share, share. That was the notification, a sound that it shared. So I can only, uh, right now, if you ask me on Surah Noor Ayat, I've told you through every, like, chastity, Surah Araf and all this. Surah Araf, you see, and all that, right? So I will try because inspired that uh, even Christian princes English is not <laughs> that good, but <laughs> but I have to struggle. We have to struggle. His knowledge is, um, I think, uh, above uh, the par. Uh, you know the average knowledge of others on this, even the Shias. He will give you a hadith uh, like, why were yellow chapel, <laughs> yellow chapel? Mm. Now I, I'm sure the Westerners, Europeans uh, know about chapel, you know, the Indian chapel, <laughs> Kolapuri. <clears throat> so, well, sometimes really, yeah, I mean, uh, you can uh, do these things uh, and they look strange to us, but we were told that God's ways are strange and mysterious. That uh, they don't, uh, it doesn't go with the normal norm, normal people that we think we are. Even Jiddu Krishnamurti has uh, mentioned this in his books. They questioned his sanity and Buddhists and all this. They questioned his san sanity and, his, and, and whether he was a devil or not, or a human. So they questioned all this and he explained it. So it doesn't mean what the norm is right now, is the normal thing, right? That's why, I mean, wearing yellow chapels, slippers, <laughs> for men it is good it's best that you if you want to challenge and you should uh, call Christian Prince join his YouTube channels everywhere in different names and please do get you see this is the way you can test yourselves how great you are in Islam this is the way you will, your eyes will open. That's why I challenge myself to go for the information and they tell me, if you are not, then leave, they time me out. I say things against uh, Christians and uh, you, but uh, he has persevered in their um, thugs. <laughs> they <laughs> have persevered. But do challenge yourself. See, by saying I'm a Shia, Shia, even the religious alims should challenge them. Please go to Christian Prince. Who was I saying the other day? On whose uh, channel? In the comment section, that right? Abdullah Samir and Abdullah Gondal came together. So I, 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 I was saying, you know, why not? Uh, uh, invite uh, like His Highness a Shia Highness. I was actually saying a Shia scholar, religious scholar, and then invite Christian Prince also. He has uh, so much knowledge. So what we were told: don't be scared of science and 
you know, like if science comes up, we have all the answers. The Quran never, science uh, will prove that the Quran is right. As uh, whatever there is about astronomy and medical t- uh, things, and hmm. so we found that no, science has disproved things uh, like the. What do you call it? The child, how he's formed and all in the stomach. Like Christian Prince was showing it. How, how it doesn't like make, because the bones and then the skin, you know, like that. So please, uh, for your own, we are told in Shia Islam that we should not be scared. Our religion is true, and we will prove it beyond reasonable evidential, scientific evidence that our religion is true, and I failed to prove. Now, please, uh, and the reason why I attacked, no, I corrected, I tried to correct Christian Prince on the Gog and Magog thing. Okay, so he don't attack Christianity there. They'll time you out. Uh, but uh, through your... The reason why I corrected uh, Christian Prince was because he was wrong on Gog and Magog. Your own uh, like... <laughs> So which surah will... See, they've corrected us on this surah, right? Do do not uh, take your monks and do not... See, this I felt the English was a little like mine. In El what did Miss Sami... Oh, I should... Sentence structure. So I went and I was like, what do I keep doing wrong in my English? In college, uh, Miss Sami was there for the mock exam. She wasn't my teacher, English teacher, but I thought I'd go and ask her. She will give me a straight reply without prejudice. In CS, unfortunately, I didn't ask my teacher like with honesty, like, what do I keep doing wrong? She was acting funny uh, with me. Do not take I, I wasn't a jughli khur, but do not, what's happened to me here is I've changed. Do not take your... Sorry, just a minute, please. Monks, or who are priests, what is this, padri, priests, well, what's the Jew, rabbis, oh yeah, as as a God, as Lords. Let's see, you have to be careful whether it's saying God or Lord Rub or what is it saying actually in Quran, uh, Arabic word. So you see there now, even our religious scholars, Shia religious scholars are silent. They take their priests and their anchorites to be their lords in derogation of Allah. In derogation of Allah, hear the word. And they take as their Lord Christ. See, in derogation of Allah and, so look at this in brackets. See the sentence structure I knew was wrong here, but I did not question my own Quran. Surah Tawbah I. 31. Huh? See, they've put in brackets here. They t- Again, an assumption that since shirk is haram, uh, shirk is unforgivable. See, again, we've reached a conclusion. And what have the people done? Translators and they've put in brackets. Or they've, okay, Sahi, we'll read this, yeah? Oh, I've got the translation. 
uh, what do you call it, Roman Arabic transliteration, sorry. Ittakhazu ahbarahum wa rubbanahum arbab min min arbab. What is arbab? Worldly lords or what does it mean really, arbab? Dunallahi wal masihab. Wal Masih ibn Mariyama wa ma umrehu. What have we done here? Again? Yes, I mean, do you mean? Doesn't matter. Ah. Yes, continue. Whoops. No. Uh. No. Oh, I lost the transliteration. See? Okay. Yeah, so I got, at least I got there, right? Okay. Surah Tawba, verse 31. Warubanahum and their monks. The rabbis, Abarham, and they, please, I'm, 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 please bear with me, I'm slow. Ittakhado, they have taken. Wama, no, Allah besada. Illahi duni min al baban as lords. Wama, and not. Mariam son, Mariam ibn wal Masiha, Jesus Christ, son of Mariam, I don't know, is Masih, it says Masih, so Christ. Liya budu illa omeru. So, wait a minute, they have taken al -Babin. Wama Mariama Ibn. What if this going on? And they worship except they were commanded. Here we go again. They have taken their scholars and monks as lords besides. Besides. Apart from. Not along with. You see, there's a. Not other than. Is it besides or is it other than, along with, apart from? So this, these are very important points that we have missed. And my friend, ex-friend used to say, other than Allah, shir kana, it is unforgivable. Okay, I'll, I think I need to take a break and then I will continue with this. It is very important that we look at this every word because uh, then we can make out what actually God means or let's see why is it important later on we'll find out why it is so it is not it's uh, it's not uh, along with Allah mm -hmm. you see that is also an important point here so I'll continue later, just let you digest all this. It's too much, even now, gathered all that information. Okay, thank you very much. I will come back later and continue.